sun in cancer moon in taurus it's nice to see when the sun and moon signs work so well together like they do in this combination here the cancer sun and taurus moon not only combine easily since they are similar to one another they also complement each other producing a character who is sensitive yet strong stubborn yet giving and emotional yet practical this practicality in particular, in my opinion, is this combination's defining characteristic. The Cancer Sun is of the water element. It is highly intuitive and uses its psychic senses to perceive the world around it. The Taurus Moon, on the other hand, is very physical and sensual in nature, being of the earth element, and so uses its heightened physical senses to perceive the world. Thus, this combination has the best of both worlds, you could say. This creates a character wise beyond their years who can use their intuitive abilities to navigate the world with grace and ease. They are very confident in their senses and so although they are often polite and charismatic, it can be nearly impossible to convince them of something which contradicts their perceptions. The moon is exalted in Taurus and the sun is in the moon's sign of domicile and cancer with this combination. And so lunar qualities and themes will be very strong in this persona. This means that um, the lunar emphasis will make them very intuitive, emotional, and very empathetic. The combination of their charisma and strong empathy can make these people highly skilled at working in hospitality or customer service industries. Although they can be sedentary in nature and not particularly ambitious, they can use their keen intuition and down-to-earth common sense to thrive in whatever environment they find themselves in. They feel very deeply and are passionate and caring toward others, but this is a mostly introverted dynamic and so these people will need to spend time alone or with people they are very close to in order to recharge. The Cancer Taurus is fiercely loyal toward those that they care about, and they take their relationships very seriously. They also have a propensity towards being a parent as their personality is very nurturing, so they'll be you know, a very uh, motherly or father fatherly type of figure. All in all, this combination has many strengths. It can be difficult being so sensitive, and the Cancer Taurus may be prone to depressions. Uh, for this, I would say to believe in yourself and your abilities, um, but also to make sure you have people in your life who you trust and um, can have a good time with, because although you are strong, independent, and can even be somewhat of a loner, it is ultimately your connections with others in life that will make you feel secure and empowered. So in other words, for this combination in particular, it's important to have a network to be able to fall back on. Uh, take care of yourself first because doing so is a necessary prerequisite to bring your nurturing energy, which we so desperately need at this time, to the world at large. And one last point, which I forgot to put into the scripting, but is very important with this combination is if you if you have this, so if you have Sun and Cancer, Moon and Taurus, you make friends very easily. Um, the Cancer Sun is going to make you want to connect with everyone, and it's going to have it's going to make you have a knack for doing so. And the Taurus Moon creates a personality which is grounded. It's, it's easygoing. Um, it's easy to relate to, easy to understand. And so, all in all, this makes a personality which is very easy for people to connect with. And um, and so, you almost have like a superpower of being able to connect with people. And so, use that and don't don't uh, take it for granted because. Not only can it make life enjoyable, it can be fun, a fun thing to have, um, but it can also be strategic. You can use it to survive. You can use it um, to thrive in life as well. So um, that's that's just one quality that I really love about this combination. Um, but that's pretty much what I have. So if you have any suggestions whatsoever, um, leave a comment or email me at manic.mercurian at gmail.com. Otherwise, thanks for watching and take care.